Hi everyone, it's Veronica. Happy Monday. Uh, I'm here, I have Olympic gold fever, I'm calling it. Uh, we have got so many gorgeous glam and golden vines and I am just taking a moment to talk to you about how that you can practice your own everyday elegance. Uh, feel luxurious and chic and put together even while you're busy and on the go. So if it's your first time joining us, I'm Veronica Stout. I'm the founder of Vintage Meet Modern Jewelry and Styling and my passion is helping women look and feel their best while dressing in details. I love mixing things from vintage and from the past with my modern life. I'm a very busy mom, a business owner. I love being able to celebrate coming together and just looking and feeling your best because I believe that you should be able to be the best version of yourself every day. I know that there's not every day is a good day, but there is something good in every day. So I am excited because again, all the beautiful things that are going on with the jewelry are just little accents to helping me live my best life. So today is a very busy day. It's Monday. Monday is a day that's always a huge day for planning. It's a big day for planning for Vintage Meet Modern. I take care of a lot of things related to another antique and restoration and reproduction furniture company that I work for. I plan out my children's schedules. I figure out what we're gonna eat and then I do everything else in between. So Mondays are a day that I intentionally plan my outfit ahead of time. And it's usually gotta be something that's really comfortable because it's also a day that usually gets slotted in with a lot of last minute errands, like zipping over to the post office for errands or for dropping off orders. Uh, it might be picking something up for lunches for the rest of the week. So I'm a big believer in making sure that you look and feel your best even while you're out you know, running around and on the go. So today I have on a t-shirt. This is a vintage style tee from J. Crew, but it is multiple seasons old. It's a bright color. And since I've been talking about the fun of wearing gold jewelry, the Olympics are on right now. And a lot of people ask about how easy it is to wear statement necklaces. So we can also do a video and address and talk about that. But primarily what I wanted to talk about today was that Gold jewelry looks really elegated, really elevant. Oh my goodness. Gold jewelry looks really elegant and elevated even if you just wear it with a t-shirt. It's just about kind of pulling it all together and having it fit your look of what you're going for that day. So it also can be very easily dressed down. Everything I have on today is something that I'm just as comfortable going with to the post office as I would be if I had to conduct a meeting or run into someone that I know professionally. So I am on this vintage style tee from J. Crew. I like it because it's very soft. It's multiple, multiple seasons old. It actually has a teeny tiny little hole in the bottom, so I tuck it in most of the time uh, because I did not have a chance to mend it yet. I have on a gold coin necklace. This is uh, 1980s. It was a Neiman Marcus purchase from one of the estates that we worked with. She was really into 1980s bold gold style which also is a nice nod to getting that couture look with your everyday feel because in the 1980s, Versace, Chanel, Gucci, coins, animal jewelry, that type of stuff, all very popular. So we can always get that really luxurious look. I like wearing a long necklace because it creates a nice line down the center of my body, which helps me feel like I look thinner. And so I like being able to do that. I have on a skinny belt that is from Meyer. Again, seasons and seasons old. And then these are those essential trousers that are from Anthropology. And again, another thing that I like to remind people, don't be afraid to take things in. So I did lose a lot of weight this year and these were actually a size 14 and I had them taken down to a size 10. So that's another important thing to keep in mind. Don't look at the labels and the sizes of your clothes, buy what fits, and don't be afraid to take a little bit of extra time to take it over to the tailor because these are a pair of pants that I probably invested. I think they go for $98 or like 98 to 125 over on Anthropology now. It's the Anthro Essential Trousers. They've been doing them for years. But 
I just took a pair of pants that I love that I knew fit me well and I just had them taken in and now I probably get another three to four years of wear out of them. So again, we're talking about investing in items that are gonna help you look and feel your best and also come out to being pennies per wear. It also prevents wardrobe wardrobe. So you don't go online and just start you know, buying a bunch of clothes uh, and then saying you're gonna take it to the tailor. One good thing is to go upstairs to your own closet and pick things that you know either need to be let out a little or taken in. So that's one tip I give you today, side note, besides the gold jewelry. And then I have on my J Crew. I don't know if you can see them, probably not. I have on those little cat toe black flats that I wear and I wear them pretty frequently. So now let's talk jewelry. There are a lot of awesome gold pieces this week. Uh, like I said, it's kind of fun because this is also Olympic week. So all of this gold jewelry is just perfect. It's like going for the gold. So this one is a really fabulous 1980s one. Again, I like this one because it doesn't interfere with anything I'm doing during the day. It's just a nice way to be able to break up my look as well as to add a little bit of an elevated touch with it with the 18 karat gold plating. But there's other options too. I always love being able to also wear uh, bright white. I think white against solids is also always a really nice accessories. It's another way that you can completely change the look of something that you wear just by adding something different. So this is a 1960s necklace. This is, the, this is more your style. And I always love mixing the bright white with the gold. It's like black and white, always classic. Gold and white, always classic. And then adding a solid color, always looks polished and elegant. So this is another one that I think is really fabulous. Uh, also, we have this really cool choker. Uh, it looks like it's a shorter piece. I think it's a vintage Vendome from the 1960s era, but it doesn't have a hallmark on it. But this one is neat because it kind of has a collar to it. So this one, it sits right in the middle, but it has this collared look to it. And I love the way that you can fill your neckline with it. And again, these styles, they're so well made. All of this jewelry, when you go back and you read about the designers that designed in the 50s and the 60s and the 70s, they'll always say they were designed actually with the woman in mind. So when we're thinking of when couture really began here in the American costume jewelry world, it was at the same time it was happening in New York. So the jewelry and the accessories designers worked with with the designers here also. So you can see how nicely and how beautifully this lays. Uh, it also has got that really beautiful, this kind of reminds me of a little bit of a fleur-de-lis style. We also had a fleur-de-lis brooch this week, but this is another one that I really like and it does have an adjustable, so if you did want to even take it up higher, you could. It also has a J hook, but it has some extra loops on it too. So you could easily be able to adjust this one. Now let's talk about that higher end couture look. Gucci is doing everything with lions right now. So this is a fun one to think about. This one has got these lions and it's a charm necklace. One time we did a photo shoot that was Versace and Gucci inspired. Uh, it was a recent photo shoot, but we actually just layered up and layered up and layered up all these necklaces. But this is another fun one. This one is the charm necklace and it has the figurals on it. It's super pretty and it just feels so good on. It's another great piece that we have. I really like this one also. I think that this would be so fun dressed up with a cocktail gown also. So another one that would be really easy to be able to wear multiple ways. Uh, and then this one is also fun. This one has got a very sleek styling to it. This one is the coin necklace, but this one also lays flat against the neck. So this one's flat against the neck. I like this one also for everyday wear. I think that it's another one that kind of blends seamlessly in. And then another fun thing about it is, it's so cool to the touch. It feels so just actually really refreshing against the skin. So this one's also beautiful. Another fun part though is, is that if you love to be matchy matchy, there is a pair of matching earrings that go with it. Or if you're thinking to yourself, well, I really love all these lions and I love this higher end couture look and style to it, but I'm not really a necklace person. We've got some really awesome statement earrings that are also part of this whole look. 
not doing this very elegantly, am I? I don't really wear pierced earrings, that's the reason why. So we've got a matching pair of earrings that have the lion motif on them also. So these are another great option. But there's also another, there are also some other fun choices uh, to keep in mind if you are looking for something to wear gold with with your solid colors. And this can work with any solid color you have. So if you like wearing solid green, solid red, uh, if you like just to layer up other shades of black, uh, you can also do, of course, tone on tone. This is a really nice option also. You can do the little turquoise earrings and bring out the turquoise that's in my shirt. So I might run around and wear this too also. This is another easy peasy one. I'm gonna stick with the necklace today because like I said, I kind of have like Olympic fever because my son, you know, Mr. Michael, he's always into all the sports stuff. So he's really enjoying it. And then if you are looking for something that's just fun and you are not a necklace person or you are always looking to add things to your collection, we also have some awesome bracelets. And bracelets are always a great option too. So we've got some really nice, big, thickier, chunkier ones, and you can do this one also. I really like this one because it has a very high end look to it, especially with the braided cable style. It reminds me of some of those Kieselstein cord pieces that were also popular in the 90s and the 2000s. So the braiding on this one is just really fabulous. So these are all great pieces. So that's kind of my tips for wearing the bold gold jewelry during this time of year. I love that it'd be very easy to be able to show you how we could dress these pieces up and then wear them with like cocktail gowns or to wear it with like a maxi dress. This would also be really super fun with, I don't know if you're familiar with uh, Heidi Houston, but she makes caftans. That would also be a really great look too, as we could layer up a whole bunch of these pieces and put them with some caftans too, because the gold would look really beautiful with those. So, all right, girls, I wanna see what you're wearing and I wanna know what kind of vintage statement jewelry you like to wear in your day-to-day -day lives, whether you are just running around, working, taking care of the family, taking care of yourself and what you're wearing when you're dressed up too. I feel that these are all ways that I know will really set you apart from the rest with everyone else. And that is truly what it's all about. It's empowering you to look and feel your best. And at the same time, we're letting all the legacy of these incredible stylish pieces live on with you. And I talked a little bit about how that I went to go get my pants altered. The best part about the jewelry is it's so worth it. It will always fit. If it looks this good today, it will look this good day today, tomorrow, forever. If we're talking about pieces that are 40, 50, 60 years old, just believe me, you are investing in something that is classic and chic and stylish and uh, empowering as well too. So, all right, everyone, I am wishing you all a fantastic day. Everything you see over here is at Vintage Meet Modern. If you have any questions related to styling or how to wear the pieces, or if real women do wear vintage jewelry every day, you know, it's as easy as just putting it on. So you don't really need to overthink it. So go grab your favorite classic solid colored shirt, pick a piece of classic bold gold jewelry with it. And I promise you, you will feel fabulous all day where you wear it and you will receive a lot of compliments too. So, all right, everyone, I will see you again real soon. Bye.